Here with an, a natural and eco-friendly alternative for plastic wrap is Sophie. I love this because you know, I, I'm concerned about plastic wrap because of the chemicals that are in it. Yes. And how, you have an alternative to that. How did you come up with this? I thought it was a tortilla you were making. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that one like, looks like a tortilla. It does. Yeah. You know, I, I was at a, an expo, mm. as one is, one of these green expos, and I saw them. And they were so beautiful uh, as gifts. And I thought, aha, I am going to make it. Here, right. smell it. All right. Can you? Smells of beeswax. Oh, wow. Beeswax. They're made of beeswax, yeah. Mm. And the thing is, you know, some uh, plastic things that used to... I don't like so much plastic in my kitchen because... Really? Well, well I, <laughs> knowing you, have you met you? Yes, I know that. We are all about green and alternative stuff. Yes. So I love that you come up with this. Yes, stuff. because it's. I think it's better to store in natural substance. Absolutely. Right. Well, you started earlier today. Oh, look how cute this is. Earlier today, let's yes. see what you did. Let's all right. Okay, okay. So I first I got a piece of fabric with uh, yellow. I did what some of bees, and this is polka dots. I cut it out with pinking shears because I didn't want it to fray. And it's 100% cotton fabric. And then I sprinkled some natural beeswax on a baking sheet. I put it in the oven for about two minutes, um, very quickly melts on 200. And then I made sure that it was fully saturated. And then I hung it up on little pegs. It dries actually very, very quickly. And that's really just to catch the drips. And, um, and then you'll see that that is as easy as it is, Christina. And there it is right there. And you see it drips into that pan uh -huh. and you can reheat that yes. and make oh, many, many more. Or them. rub it on your body. You know? Well, no, you no, actually you wouldn't want yes, to. No, no. So no. How, do you, how do you use them, though? Yeah. All right, so how you use them is this. You can use them in a multitude of different ways to, to store your food. Here, I have them in bowls. And I love, Christina, help me with this. Yes. I want to show you. Okay. They make lovely bowl covers because what you can do is you take it and the warmth of your oh, hand is pliable. Yes. It's very, very oh. pliable. And then you can put it down like this and you can literally just mold it around mm. the bowl. And when you do that, Mark, it will Oopsie. stay in that shape forever, you have like to that. It then? Oh my goodness! Look at that. Isn't that sweet? And you can make lots of little bowl covers. Also, the other thing that I love to use it with is I wrap cheese, mm -hmm. and then this one here, I made a little sandwich wrapper, which I did a lot when Lola was younger, like this. And then I line it just with a little bit of parchment paper, and it just keeps it that is so brilliant. fresh. And may I ask you, this paper here does not have white spots on it from that. This is the paper. It has white spots on it normally. It's, it's polka paper. dots. Polka dot yeah. paper. Yes. Yeah. So it doesn't. Oh, yeah. No. Yeah. It looks really bright yeah, yellow yeah, like there. And then, how do you uh, dishwasher safe? It looks like you're going to throw that like a frisbee. I know, right? No, I, know. I, <laughs> I want to eat it like a tortilla. Yeah, yeah, exactly. No, how do you clean um, it? You actually just run it under cold water because beeswax is naturally antibacterial. So all you oh. need to do is run it under cold water. You Boy, can... Those bees are good. They, they are, they are so amazing good. little And critters. you can use a little bit of, of, of um, eco-friendly dish soap. I'm sorry, I yeah. think this is brilliant. I yeah. really, really do. This is just wonderful, the little sandwich in there like that. And then I've used these little so buttons here, Christina. And then what I wanted to show oh, you is buttons. that... Little bee buttons, like that. Oh my goodness. And what I wanted to show you is that when I sew these on, I was thinking, will this be easy on, on wax? But it actually goes through really, really easy easily and then what I'm doing is I'm using a kitchen twine here and you can get them in these really fun colors take it off and then you just snip it off like that and then it's just you another just way that you've got a little closure like Oh, that's so. Is this an affordable solution? What are, what are we talking it's about? It's very affordable. I mean, when I first saw them, Mark, at the expo, like as gifts like that, yeah. I think they make great holiday gifts. Sure. I, it was 15 to $20 for a pack of three, and I'm making them for $2 for a pack of three. R wow. That this, shocks you. That, yeah. Yes. Brilliant. That's I really, amazing. really am impressed with They're this. They're beautiful. <laughs> that's They're great, beautiful. Sophie. They're really How come lovely. it says your name? It should say it's my name. It's Sophie. It's my name. For more information, you can visit sophieuliano.com and our Pinterest page. Brilliant. Love, love, Very, love. very good. Kristen. Do not go away. When we're coming back, Kristen is going to take over. Me. Yeah, I'm taking over the world. How about a high chair in a bag? Stress-free tips for mommies this travel season. Coming up.